What's up YouTube? What you know? My name is Domino with the Zero and welcome back to Pokemon Platinum, our severely randomized Nuzlocke episode number 10. In the last episode, we traveled around Eterna City, um, the city that we're in right now. We met Cynthia, the champion of the Sinnoh region, and battled our way through most of the trainers here in the gym. You do want to go back and check that out because, like I said, we met a very important character. Click the i card up at the top of the screen. In today's episode, we're going to be taking on this second gym here in the Sinnoh region and hopefully collecting our second badge in the Sinnoh region. So if you're excited for another episode in the Sinnoh region, hit the like button down below and do subscribe to become a member of the Domination. Help us grow this to being what the actual main series should be and being the most successful channel on, or excuse me, most successful series on the channel <clears throat> While you're down there, go ahead and hit the, uh, what? Go ahead and comment the question of the day, which is going to be, if you could take over any gym in the Pokemon world, in any of the cities that are already made, where would it be and what type would you change it to? So, I was trying to, I wanted it to be something gym inspired, but I've done so many of these gym related questions, I didn't want it just to be another, another, what's your favorite, etc, etc. Um... I want to know what you would, uh, where you would take over. So if you saw the Pokemon anime with Brock and Misty when they came uh, in the Sun and Moon stuff, um, they had turned it into a rock slash water gym. So I don't know exactly where I would. Maybe I'll come up with it over the episode. Uh, but before we do something, let's go ahead and do a team recap. We did have a grinding montage. First up, we have Dagny, our the Dagny, the unreliable, our level 21 water fighting type Hypno with Steel Wing, Overheat, Leech Seed, and me first. Then we have Nadia, the legendary, uh, level 21 poison normal type Palkia with Bug uh, Signal Beams, Power Swap Block, and Attract. We learned Attract. I tried it to see it doesn't work because we don't have a we don't have a gender. Then we have Manali, the starter that you all helped me choose, our level 22 Dark Rock type Rhydon holding the Razor Fang with Headbutt, Ice Punch, Bounce, and Detect. And lastly, we have Zekomo, the Slow Mo, our level 22 Fire Bug type Tauros holding the Quick Clock because we are extremely slow with Fire Fang, Crunch, Rock Smash, and False Swipe. Now, as you can see, two level 21s, two level 22s, we are going into this gym under leveled. The gym leader is going to, I think, have a couple 22s and maybe even a 24. So we're going in just slightly under level because I do want that challenge, but I also don't want to lose Pokemon. So let's get to it. I'm pretty sure last time, yeah, so we're 
We're already here. Actually, I'm going to stand right here in front of you, Gardenia. So, I want to think real quick. Pewter City is a possibility, but there's not really much to do in Pewter City. Vermilion City isn't bad. It's right by the, the coast, right? Uh, sort of. Sort of. I mean, there's, there's like, the port there. Um... Celadon City, I mean, is an actual city. Actually, Saffron City's not bad either. Cinnabar Island isn't horrible. There's a lot of towns in the Pokemon world. I might just do Snowpoint City. <laughs> I might take over Snowpoint City and just make it into a dark type gym. And uh, have my Umbreon, have my Weavile, my Incineroar. That's all I need. All right, here we go. Oh, you kept me waiting. I need turn as gym leader Gardenia, the grass type master. When I first saw you, I was convinced you'd find your way to me. My hunch was right on the money. You have a winning aura about you. So anyway, this will be fun. Let's have our battle. All right, here we go. Botanist Chloe. Bring it. That's what I was saying. Level 22. All right. With a uh, 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 snow warning. Gosh darn it. It's an Alolan Vulpix. Don't fall for it. It's an Alolan Vulpix. Okay, it's also... What type am I? I'm type dead! <laughs> oh, crap. All right, all right, hold on. Are we recording? Gosh darn it, I was hoping I wasn't recording, so I'd have to start over. Dagny, okay, well, Dagny was water type, and it has seed flare. I can't go into Manali. I could go into Nadia. Zacomo is also bug fire. Actually, I'm gonna go Zacomo. Zacomo is the smarter move right now. I'm gonna go Fire Fang because it's uh, stab. Eruption will do a decent amount, but I think we'll be okay. <laughs> Alright, anyway, sorry. <laughs> Woo! I have energy for days right now. Wait. Someone told me that Blastoise... Someone told me that Blastoise was dangerous. Someone told me... I don't remember if that was before I re-randomized it? Or... or what? Oh crap, that's gonna hurt a lot. Oh god, that's gonna hurt so much. Oh stop, 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 please. Yes. Alright, I've gotta heal. I've gotta heal. Because I'm not trying to lose the Como, okay? I'm not trying to lose the Como. Why do you have a leftovers? Wait. Oh you have a citrus berry. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. So I'm gonna heal with a super potion. You like how I did how I moved the cursor? Uh, because of the way, like, some, uh, hacks are, you can't see it. You can't see the cursor very well, so I wanted to make sure I was on the right Pokemon. That does a little too much. And while the hail's going, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to heal spam just a little bit. I apologize, but I don't want to lose. And I don't know if I win if Zacomo goes down. And I like Zacomo. I've never used a Tauros of any kind, ever. So getting to use a Tauros is really cool. But if this thing's just going to kill itself... So I have 100 right now, and it does 44. Hail does an additional 6. So it does exactly 50. I, I, I'm sorry, I can't. Now as soon as the hail stops, I will risk a crit and go for it. Botanist Chloe is also going for it. Okay. 
We're going. Let's attack. Let's freaking go. I'm gonna try Crunch and see if that does any better. Why would you try Crunch when it's proven that F uh, Fire Fang is a two-hit KO? You know, I just don't have an answer for that. Oh, you have Wonder Guard! That's why I heard that Blastoise is scary. Well, crap. Um, Fire Fang hit, right? Right? I'm not dreaming, am I? I mean, he's going to kill himself eventually, right? Can the hail stop? Does the hail never stop in Gen 4? Hey Siri, look up hail in Gen 4. Okay. No, stop it. I hate you. Okay, I found this on the web for hail in Gen 4. I don't know if you could hear Siri, but I could hear Siri. Let's find out. I wanna I wanna find out. Effect. Gen 4. With ice body, no. Heavy rain, hail, no, 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 no. Okay, so it doesn't say anything special. It says five turns. Okay, it doesn't say anything special. So I've got to, I've got to heal. I don't like to use the speed up button in a gym battle for sure. So there's the crit. No, no, hail, stop. No, hail, no, hail, no! I wanted to use the cup. Wait, it dies. It dies. I'm, I win. No! Zacomo! The slow mo! Darn it! Why did it have to crit on that turn? She said it's not the end yet. Doesn't that confuse me? What is this hail? Was that thing holding an icy rock? Are you saying something? You think you had me cornered? Yeah. Die! Ah, get out of here. Get out of here. Go. Shoo. Shoo. All right, we won, but dang it. Ah, uh, amazing, you're very good, aren't you? All right, here, go, here goes more Gardenia voice. I might have said it before, but you're really tough. Wasn't it hard for you to raise your Pokemon to be like so good? I guess that's a measure of how much you love your Pokemon. In recognition of that, I proudly grant you this. I lost everybody! Can use cut outside of battle. Now that you have two gym badges, all the Pokemon received in trades, blah 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 blah. TM86, it's probably not gonna be what she tells us. Drain Punch? Whoa. I'm gonna need you to calm down. Drain Punch is actually really good. Oh! Uh, playing too many games. Uh. Drain Punch. Who can learn Drain Punch? Ooh, both of them can learn Drain Punch. Dagny's unable, but Dagny was a fighting type, so that would have actually been decent for Dagny. Gosh darn it, man. That's so frustrating. Okay. In the last episode, we did get cut. We received cut last episode from... No. Yeah, I think it was just last episode that we received it. I feel like there, both of those losses that I took, there was no way I would have known. Oh my gosh, we're on episode 10 and we already have five people. Dagny, the unreliable. You actually, it wasn't your fault. It wasn't your fault that you got blown away. How was I supposed not to think had Seed Flare? And Zacomo, if you wouldn't have gotten crit, you would have lived. He would have won that battle. Darn it. 
All right. Brass electric. I feel like I'm stupid if I don't pick this up. I feel like I'm absolutely stupid if I don't pick up Itoro. Okay, and aren't you psychic? No, you're steel. Hey Siri, what level does Goldeen evolve? Don't you even say that out loud. Oh, you were so close, dude. Have a look. Okay, I found this on the Siri, I'm gonna get really mad at you. Hold on, hold on, just a moment. There we go. Okay, I found this on the web for what level does Goldini evolve? That's what I said. How come you couldn't come up with that on your own, Siri? Twenty-four, twenty-two, something like that. Thirty-three. Heck no. All right. For now, we're just gonna go with this because I think these two can probably carry us for now. But I think I do have an experience share. In fact, I'm pretty sure I have an experience share. All right, Itoro is given the experience share. Man, I just grinded those guys up too. All right, I need to teach cut to somebody. Everyone can learn it. Nadia only has, let's look at how he is. I wanna see when Palkia learns stuff. Like, what levels? Is it just every 10 or what? Jeez. Okay, so it learns moves at... That's not even... Oh, I see. Maybe. I don't know, this doesn't... I don't know if this makes sense to me. Yeah, it's every 10 levels, so... Oh, wait. Yeah, yeah, it's every 10 levels. So at level 30, it'll learn something. At level 40, it'll learn something. Level 50, it'll learn something. I guess it is Stab, now that I stop and think about it. So there's that. I mean, I'm just gonna get rid of Attract. It could be worse. I it could be worse. I mean it's it's stab, so we're gonna go ahead we're gonna go with it. Alright, now instead of running up in the galactic base, what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna take the opportunity. We also just lost our false swiper. Oh, oh Gardenia's here. Alright, well let's just talk to Gardenia. Hiya, were you intrigued by the rumors going around too? You know, people have been talking about the ghost Pokemon of the old Chateau. I've been hearing rumors about sinister shadows, too. I should check it out myself, but going in there is... Well, you know, being that I'm a gym leader, I'm, I'm always busy. So since I'm so busy, I can't go in. It's not because I'm scared. So, so, so good luck with your investigation. <laughs> yeah, sure. Cut that tree. Should be an item there. Ooh. Ah, we're not training right now. Ah, we're not training right now. Remember when I could have had a giraffe rig? Or what did I? What did, I think it was two giraffe rigs that I encountered, wasn't it? I think it was. I think that was it. I don't really remember for sure, to be honest. All right. Well, let's enter the old chateau. And we do get an encounter in here. So whatever our first Pokemon that we encounter is, it's right here. We get a Skorupi. Oh, Skorupi. Okay. I'm gonna cut you. Nadia. Nadia the control. Nadia the controlled. Let's go, Nadia. One, two, three. 
this actually happening. Okay, I, I wasn't sure if that was actually happening, so I had to hold the speed up button to find out. Alright, uh... I think it's another female name. We're getting all the females. Scorupi, the fighting type scorpion Pokemon. As soon as its tails, as soon as the tail claws close, its needle tips secrete poison. It can survive a year without food. What? Why would you want to survive a year without food? I'm going to struggle fasting for however many days it is. I'm going to die, but that's a whole different story. Huh, I'm actually going to die. Uh, but we have Halima... Our Skorupi! Let's check him out. Her. Check her out. As long as she's not bad, we'll go ahead and hold on to her. She's carrying TMO5, fighting type, adamant nature! With quick feet! Holy cow! This Pokemon is amazing! We've got Vice Grip, Psy Beam, Smoke Screen, and Haze. This Pokemon is amazing! Holy cow! What's TMO5? Halima, what did you bring me? Gastro acid. It's okay, Halima. You can only be so good. We could have found Per Ugly. Let's let's be thankful. Let's be thankful that we did that we found an encounter in that first room. Scorupi's not bad. Now I found another sacred ash. Oh my goodness. You know, maybe that should have been the question of the day. What's something you always have to do in every single Pokemon game? For me, I have to check every single trash can. And I feel like there's never anything in the trash cans. Never a thing in the trash cans. Never. But because of Gen 1, when there was, there was one thing. And because of Lieutenant Surge's gym. You know what? You know what I would do to answer our question of the day? I would take over the uh I would take over the Vermilion City gym and close it. We don't need that kind of negativity in our lives. Okay. You know, I, I, I'm not a fan of repels. However, Getting a little crazy. Found a splash plate. Cool. I guess. What kind of Pokemon can we find in here? Bar fetch it. I'm pretty sure it's only one Pokemon that you can encounter in this entire area. I'm pretty sure there's something special. Wait. It's an old notebook. There's something scrawled in it. Something so peculiar should make off with the motion. What? This music is pretty wild. Alright, we're gonna head into the back room and that honestly might be it. I don't... I don't know what else there is to do. I mean, I know what we need to do next, but we're just going to save that for the next episode. Oh, goodness. Wait, isn't it all the way to the left? Oh, I could have had a Crobat! Brock! I should save. I can't save. Alright, well. I can't save. <laughs> but make sure you save. Or, I don't know, some YouTuber tells us why we should save all the time, but that's a different story. The TV has an oddly malevolent, malevolent feel. It's as if it was staring. Wait, wait, wait. Do I have to come back at night? I don't play this game at night. Give me a break. Give me a break. This is my afternoon game. Actually, my afternoon game. I, I break fourth walls all over the place. I... I I break so many fourth walls, I might as well stop talking about breaking the fourth wall. Because it's just like, the wall is literally there to be broken. But, um, BP. Okay, I, 
started to get a little chill uh, because I was maybe hoping that the girl would just be standing right outside the door. Just like, hi! Like, oh my god! You know what I'm talking about. Whenever you open a door to something and someone is already standing there, like, not intentionally trying to scare you, but just like, you know, you're you're thinking, okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go ahead and leave this room. And the other person is thinking, okay, I'm just going to go ahead and enter this room. Whoever opens the door to see the other person standing there is going to get scared. Like, isn't, is that just, is that just me? Am I just a wuss? If I'm just a wuss, just tell me. It's okay. It's okay. I can take it. I can take it. All right. Well, here's what we're going to do. Uh, I would say that our trip in here was actually pretty successful. Um, oh, it was a... Was my encounter a grotto? I don't remember. Or it died. Uh, but anyway, I need to get off the speed up button. Um, we are going to go ahead and wrap up the episode right here. Uh, I don't know if it seems short. It seems short to me. Um, looking at the time, it's not as short as I thought it was going to be. Uh, but this is the perfect time to go ahead and wrap up. In the next episode, we are going to be using Cut to get into the Team Galactic base and challenge them for the first time. Uh, I have to decide between now and when I record that episode if I'm going to grind up the two new members of our team. Um, I might just grind them like to level 20 or something like that. Um, in fact, I think that's what I'm going to do. But anyway, if you wound up enjoying today's second gym battle, yeah, second gym battle in the center region, make sure to hit the like button down below and do subscribe to become a member of the Domination. And while you're at it, go ahead and comment the question of the day, which was if you could live... If you could take over any gym in the Pokemon world, which gym would it be and what type would you change it to? Again, my thinking there is like, the design of so-and-so's gym is really cool, or the location of it is really is where I would like to live. I'll take over that one and change it into this type. And we'll see you tomorrow for the next episode of Pokemon Platinum. Until then, spread positivity, be the light, and have a blessed day.